Hey guys, this is Eclipse Gaming KSB, and um, I'm sorry about that uh, little break I took. Um, I was so busy recording that I forgot to upload. But yeah, um, I'm back with Epic Replicas, finally. Boy, I, I did manage to get the lag issues resolved, but only by removing all my mods. So everything you're going to see here is completely stock. Yes. Look at this bad boy. This is the F-15. It's got three bombs and a couple missiles. It can carry up to two Kerbals in its cockpit. And this took like forever to build. It's got something over 250 parts. So it's ridiculous. Anyway, let's um go ahead and throttle up to 100%. And here we go, rolling down the runway. Look at that. This design actually looks pretty decent, in my opinion. Look at it. It takes a while to get it off the ground, though, with all that uh, weapons load. See how I did the intakes there? Yeah, that looks pretty cool. I dare to say that this is one of the best F-15 replicas I have ever seen. <laughs> Completely non-biased. Anyway, yeah, it can maneuver, kind of. Uh, 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 okay. And, uh, okay, we saved it. <laughs> I love this thing already. And that's the first time I've ever taken it out, too. So, yeah. For those of you who don't know what Epic Replicas is yet, you should probably go watch the first video. But if you really don't want to do that, it's basically uh, this series where um, you guys submit requests for airplanes I should try to replicate in Kerbal Space Program, and rockets too, I suppose. Um, and I attempt to build them, provided it's not like over the top or anything. Um, and this is about as complex as it's going to get, this F-15. So I'm going to try and keep them stock from now on. In the first video you saw I used several mods. So one of those went straight, at least. Whatever. And bombs away. Anyway, yeah, you, you submit what you want me to do. I attempt to do it. Except because I, um, I'm not doing any epic replica- or I wasn't doing any epic replicas due to the big lag problem. You guys didn't submit anything. And the ones you did submit were propeller planes, which would've worked before, but didn't now. Basically, I'm revising the rules. They have to be jet planes. <laughs> or rockets. But, anyway, yeah, this is going pretty well. Do I have any stuff left? Yeah, I still have a bomb left. You'll see how I uh, clipped a whole bunch of wings together there and used that uh, R8, is that the name of it? The little winglet thing to angle the tips of the wings like they are in the real F-15. Flies pretty well. Let's uh, aim it down a little here. And bombs away, finally. Let's see what this does. Ooh, boom! Pull up. Alright, now this guy can maneuver, now that we've gotten rid of all that extra weight. You'll notice my use of his little structural panels. It's a pretty ugly plane from the bottom. From the top it looks okay, though. I wasn't really paying that much attention to the bottom of it. I have a whole bunch of wings clipped into the fuselage there, which um, are more for appearance than lift, although they do help with lift, because this thing just had barely enough lift to take off in the first place. So I added some more, and now it can not only take off with a full load, but it can kind of maneuver, sort of. So anyway, let's see what it takes to get this thing to go out of control. That was a really high angle of attack, but it didn't go out of control yet. Let's see. Let's pitch up, and then pitch down. Like that. That did it. Hmm, that was surprisingly anticlimactic. Okay, let's turn on the afterburners to try and push us back off. Let's see. And we are back in control. That was easy. That wasn't too bad at all. How about that? Okay, let's uh, turn the plane back towards the runway here. We are going 373 meters per second. 74. 75. 375. Wow, that's fast. 
see that with uh, no weapons, this is a pretty fast little plane. Well, it's not little. Pretty fast big plane. So yeah, we've got some fuel left. Not particularly fuel efficient, but I think it works. Start to see a little bit of mock effects in the left wing there, on the cockpit. See right there? Um, yeah. So yeah, this plane's completely stuck except for the afterburners, which is a modded part that I created. I do have the craft file for it without the afterburners, and uh, if you guys show enough interest, I'll upload that um, onto Dropbox, probably. But anyway, yeah. Cool beans. Let's uh, see if we can land this bad boy. Is the gear down? Yeah, the gear's down. Okay. Hey, we're gliding. Since when do fighters glide? How about that? This is a pretty good little glider, <laughs> considering it's got like little delta wings. Okay, we're down. It's kind of a bad landing, but nah, who cares? Breaking. Okay then. That worked pretty well. Let's uh, let's see what we can do here. Let's uh, go to the space center and choose our next plane. So there's the F-15, by the way, in case you didn't get that. Let's um, clear the runway and proceed here. Um, and our second plane, let's see, where is it? Should be over here. Uh, IAI Kafir. We're choosing the afterburning version. I will give you the craft file if you show enough interest, again, for the non-afterburning version. But yeah, this is the one with the afterburners. It's a nice little plane. Well, kind of. It's ugly. <laughs> Look at that. Um, normally, I would have showed the build process for this, um, but I forgot, so I'm just going to explain a little bit of how it works. You can see the uh, two delta wings there. Pretty simple. You can see the uh, missile, which is just four of the delta wings. Um, it's just four of those octagonal strut things with some separatrons angled on there. That should work better than the missiles on the F-15. Uh, you can see the nose cone consists of a uh, nose cone with a tail cone clipped into it. It's kind of ugly, but it works. Then we've got another tail cone and nose cone combination behind the cockpit to make it blend in well. Um, what else? You can see the um, uh, the canards there. But yeah, it's an ugly plane, but she is a hell of a lot of fun to fly, as you were about to see. Yeah, let's see here. And we're already off the ground, look at that. This flies so much better than the F-15. It's uglier, but it flies better. Let's see. You'll notice the decouplers there, the little decouplers are the bombs. There's four on each side. Look at that roll rate. Alright. Pull off. Look at that high angle of attack we got before losing control. It was pretty good. Let's see here. Is there anything else? Yes! Yeah, wow, this is remarkable. We're already going over 230 meters per second. Or I'm at 210, sorry. 250. Let's see. Wow! That was how many G's was that? That was like 12 G's. Spider fold. We're just like going up. Wow. I love this plane. Whoa! Crap. You can lose this control a bit easier than the, uh, so it's not the easiest to fly, but it's fun. Look at it. Okay, no view inside the cockpit, obviously, because I don't have that mod installed. Let's, um... Let's see, anything else? Mm -hmm. Nah. Let's see. So, uh, turn the plane around. Without losing control, preferably. It would be a shame to lose control of this thing. Yeah. She's not easy to fly, but she's fun. You're dead, VAB. Dead. I'm gonna get you. You're gonna pay for all the stuff you've done to us. Bombs away. Bombs away. Bombs away. There. Is that gonna hit it? Bullseye! <laughs> okay. Let's go up. Um, and around. And grab not that much around. 
All right, yes, let's just go retrograde. That's a great idea. All right, let's see here. I like this plane. It's ugly, but I like it. What else do we have here? I didn't bother to set up action groups for these bombs and this and stuff. I just put in staging, because why not? The canards there are like double canards. It's, it's the little uh, R8 winglets, I think they're called. Correct me if I'm wrong. But there are one right on top of the other. If you look carefully, you can see that. Especially if you're in 720p, you ought to be able to see that. Ah, uh, let's see. Let's get the uh, space plane hangar. Let's drop those bombs. And fire the missiles. See, those missiles fire a lot better. I missed. That was more of my bad aiming than it was the bad missiles. So now let's land the plane. Yes. <laughs> On the section of runway. What a good idea, right? Uh, let's um, line it up. Put the gear down. <laughs> and, okay, never mind. Let's go around. There's no way I would have been able to stop there. Wow, without any missiles or bombs at all, we can really maneuver this thing. Now that's tail heavy too, we could burn some fuel. Okay, let's uh, turn the plane around. Oh, crap. Crap. Uh, okay, we got our control back. Let's uh, try and turn ourselves around, this time without losing control, right? Oh, cr crud. Spoke too soon. Crap, 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 oh. You didn't see that. You did not see that. Okay, straight up. Look at that. It's a rocket. Okay, let's get the space plane hanging, because why not? Okay. Ah, glory at last. And let's flip the plane around. She's pretty stable retrograde. How about that? Very stable retrograde. Okay, let's fire the engines. Think that out. That would get a crowd in an air show. What else can we do with this baby? Let's try and do the retrograde trick again. Let's see. Ah, yes, we're retrograde. We. I'm gonna fire the engine in just a second here. We're gonna try and level ourselves out. Oh, 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 okay. Thought for a minute we were gonna crash. See so, ya. Yeah. The, um. Oh, uh, 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 you didn't see that either. Let's land. Um. So yeah. Okay, that does it for this episode of Epic Replicas. Don't forget to submit your crafts. And yeah, I'm glad I'm back. Till next time, explode responsibly.